you. You have distinguished yourself in battle. Excelente, amigo. You are worthy in my eyes. You may use this ship, the Black Skull, anytime you like. Ah, many thanks to you. This ship can get us back to Rogueport in no time. Let us get away from this coconut pit and back home. Come, everybody. Oh, I can't wait to get home! You've been looking forward to this for so long! Returning home alive is all the treasure I need! For real! Now get this boat moving! Well, that is all there is to it then. Am I not correct? To see you, Captain Mario. Hey Mario, give my regards to the boss, will you? Yeah, I'm gonna stay here. It's a right nice place to live without any ghosts, eh? I'm sure they'll be all fine here. Let's go, Mario. Prepare, uh, prepare, amigos. Cast off. Yay! We did it. We have completed chapter five. That was fun. I enjoyed that. It was a good time. What a joy. And thus our adventure came to an exciting end, eh? The ship sailed smoothly onto Rogueport, and soon we saw the harbour of our bow. I did not find treasure, but I am satisfied nonetheless, strange though it sounds. For I have found something even more precious than doubloons, yes. Even now, I hear the crew readying the dock. The time is right to close this journal. To all who wander the seas, Flavio's blessing upon you. It's good to be back in Rogueport. Last we return, slavered in glory, to my hometown, sweet Rogueport. Of course, it is only because of my courageous efforts that we returned at all, huh? But of course, you all know that, and know it well. Yes, yes, Master Flavio! But now please excuse us! Perhaps chance we will bring us uh, all together again someday! Uh, what? Hey, where are you all leaving already? Now that was harsh. Such is life, Captain Mario. You are anxious to continue your own adventure also, huh? One day you may surpass the great and fabulous Flavio in greatness and fabulousness. It is not likely, I assure you, but you should, how you say, shoot for the stars, eh? If uh, ever you should... Oh, um, memento, that reminds me. If you ever get the urge to return to Keelhole Key, just say the word, see? I will send you to the Ela faster than the fastest winds can blow. Yes, yes, you giant skull, you. Your time in the spotlight is done, and get over yourself. <clears throat> Well, my adoring fans have gone, so I will be excusing myself now as well. If you see me in town, I would permit you to say hello to me. May we meet again, eh? Yeah, I'll just say Luigi's over there, isn't he? Well, Maya, we probably ought to go too, don't you think? Let's go to the door! Yeah, we probably should. Let's go to the door, but let's speak to Luigi first. Alright. We got another piece of that mother's compass. Alright. Uh, I turned adventuring into an art form on that, li that little quest. Whew. It is pretty dramatic, bro. Wanna hear what happened? Yeah, I do. Well, like I said, it's a really long story. As soon as we hit Jazz Fast Town, we were overcome by the glitz and glamour. It's a very lively place, bro. Tons of daisies live there and they're always smiling. While looking for the piece of the compass, I met a hip daisy named Hazy. Hazy was a producer and he was looking for actors to go on stage with him. I told him we couldn't, since we were looking for the compass part, you know. But Hazy said we could win the compass part in the upcoming Drama Slam. He said the so-called Drama Lama Plague might, in fact, be one of the parts. Well, we just had to give it a try, so we rehearsed with the cast and hit the stage. Our musical was called The Mystery of the Fiery Hat of Social Awareness. The script was great, but I got really hold, bro. My role, my part was grass. I played grass by the side of the road. Grass, bro, grass. I just sprawled out on the ground and had to be silent. Everyone but me had lines. I don't care if I was wearing green. Who cares someone based on that? It was awful. 
In the end, our musical was the talk of the town, and we won the drama slam. I got the compass part I was after, but even that didn't make me very happy. The huge after party just made me feel worse, so I snuck out the back door. But wow! Outside were tons of my fans! My fans! Fans of grass! They swarmed me! I just couldn't believe it. Imagine, cheering for grass! I was ecstatic, bro. After that, I added the, the piece of the marvelous compass, which pointed north. It pointed to the rapturous ruins in Grimble Forest. Then, the voice again. Oh, my cherished princess, Claire, how you soothe me. I will be grass for you. I will find you. I will reach you. I will stand by your side and be your Luigi. Oh, wow, sorry about that, bro. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, anyway, then I got back on my boat and I came back to the boat. Yeah, okay, yeah. I need a drink for that voice. I don't know why that voice hurts my throat so much, but it does. What this? Boat? I may as well check out what this is. It seems like it's a secret thing. Whew. What have we got back here? Oh, unboat. There's a chest. And a star piece. Oh, yeah, so drop modes attack power by one, but we gain one HP when attacking. Very good if you're going for the strat of keeping health. Um, if that's your playstyle, very, very good item. Uh, I'm not going to go for that, but I appreciate its existence. Yeah. So, let us, uh, let's head for the door. I was actually just... I'm loving this remix, by the way. Uh, hey, that's your ring, Mario. That's been emailed from Princess Peach. Check it. Uh -huh. Dearest Mario, I have good news. I don't know where I'm being held, but there's an odd computer called Tech here. By cooperating with this Tech, I've managed to obtain some of these fiends' data. Tech is currently analysing it, and strange as it may sound, I trust them. Once this analysis is done, I should be able to provide you with details of their plans. I'll email you again once I learn more. Be good, okay? Wow, that Princess Peach is totally awesome. Go, girl. We better get to work, too. So, yeah, if I'm not mistaken, would it be quicker? Yeah, I was enjoying that pirate remix. Oh, okay. We got another issue. Late in the afternoon today, Gomez, known for napping in the flowers in the Westside Park, was found eating flowers and given a stern warning by the authorities. As for comment, Gomez stated, Well, I just really, really love flowers, and I was hanging out, and before I knew it, they were in my mouth. I'm so ashamed. Citizens of Rogueport responded with disbelief and grudging support for the strengthening of flower con conservation efforts. This time, we intro introduced the Twilight Shop. Watching the husband and wife proprietors of this shop at work is a heartwarming sight. But don't get on the husband's bad side. Don't you go smiling at my wife, says the jo jovially jealous shopkeeper. I'm hers for life, and your fancy big city teeth aren't going to change that. Well, who could doubt their eternal love? Surely not this reporter. We pressed the shopkeeper for further comment, but regret that his words are unprincipled here. We did learn from, from his highly chatty spouse, but there will be a double point sale in all... Okay, next 15 minutes, right, I'll be on that. Um, Alright, my little rookies, we're on to an intermediate level recipe today. The dish is a healthy salad. Just slice up a turtle leaf and a horsetail. Mix them together and you're done. Perfect for your next gathering of herbivores. Okay. Uh, doing well is Jolene. Alright. Huh. Stand a comeback. Well, that's nice. Spicy. But I don't forget that. Okay, I don't really care. I want, I've got 15 minutes to get to Twilight Town. Um, which is actually admittedly very, very easy. Um, is there anything there that's super cheap to get double points? So I'm just trying to work out what my best options are. Um, but it's good to know that there is a sale on. I wonder how it works. Is it 15 minutes from when you read the email or from when you receive it? Because they are very different things. Oh, there is no cheap option, is there? Okay, what I'm going to do... Um... Having a... Yes, okay, so I'm going to store a bunch of things. 
Um, I'm gonna store all the ruin powder, incubon, yeah, this, this, uh, okay, whack -a bumps that'll do for now, I guess. Um, and then I'm gonna sell some stuff. I, how much is them? Oh, Super Mushroom only sells for two? Wow, okay. I'm not gonna sell that then. Sell the coconut. And the kill mango. Because I don't need it right now. Uh, maybe I shouldn't have sold it. Ah, I don't care. I can get another one. Um, right, so I'm holding. Okay. Okay, so the cheapest thing here is this. I will buy reluctantly many of, many of these. Because double points. It's worth it, technically. And then I will sell them all. It's not thrilling gameplay, but it's necessary. 69! Nice! Yay! I get a shooting star. Ooh, nice! Not bad. Very nice indeed. Alright. I guess I'm gonna sell all those uh, smoke patches. How much do they sell for? Five. Okay. So I'm only losing five coins at a time. That's not that bad. That's all right. Um, so how many times do I want to do this? I mean... How many times... If I was to buy ten, I would be losing 25 coins a piece. I could theoretically get to 200, coin, 200 points right now. I'm not going to. I'll do it one more time and then I'll stop. Because it's just boring to watch. And I know that. But I could theoretically do it. If you could buy in bulk, like if it let me buy, instead of one at a time, I could buy, you know, like all of them. Uh, like if I could just buy eight, I would do that right now and there'd be nothing stopping me and it'd be great. But I can't, so it's very annoying. But, uh, yeah, it's what it is. I'm here to sell. Those things I just bought from you, I like to get rid of them. It's, uh, it's a loss for me, but I want those sweet, sweet points. I want to look at the, uh, the sign as well and see what, like, what the, uh, the price of stuff is. Like, uh, how, what, what, like, the point system is like. Because I don't remember how much our, uh, how much things cost. Yeah, that'll, that'll do me. That's fine. It's not the best, it's not the worst, it'll do. Um, so, gold bar, life mushroom, mushroom, gem, gem, gold bar. Okay. Okay, it's not too bad. Um,. music's so good. Um, but yeah, there we go. That's that done. Um, let me head to the Crystal Star Door. The Thousand Year Door. You know the name of the game, but I forgot briefly. <laughs> yeah, that. You remember that? Yeah, I'm familiar with his work. Thank you. Um, yeah, we're doing that. Oh, that's changed. Interesting. We got more powerful creatures around. Ho ho ho. What does that mean? It means danger. Fun. Fun for all the family. we go, 5 of 7. Looking pretty good. Ooh, what is this? 
It's a magical fountain, we're going there. Yeah. Come on, let's go talk to Professor Frankly. Oh, yeah. Yes, let's. <laughs> Great news, my friends. Now we know the next crystal star is in Poshley Heights. Wait a sec. You mean where all the rich and famous people live? Like movie stars and stuff? Yes, yes, and I believe Poshley Heights is also home to a shrine to the stars called Poshley Sanctum. The next crystal star must be hiding inside that shrine. I'm certain of it. F fairly certain, mo mostly certain. But hey, no fearsome monsters or dangerous dungeons this time. Just a simple tourist attraction. Sir, so, a little help here? To get to Poshley Heights, we should... That's the best part. You ride the most famous train of all, the Excess Express. Yes, after a luxurious steam engine excursion, the next crystal star will be yours. Getting those crystal stars have been back-breaking work, but this time will be a cinch. But I think we have to be, like, obscenely rich to get an Express Express ticket. Hmm, that may be true. Perhaps you should ask Don Pianta for help with this too. Oh, no, 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 not that moody, moody mobster again. Oh, well, I guess not much choice, huh? Come on, Maya, let's go. Excellent. Then we're set. We may not have much time until the demon resurrects. We must hurry. I'll gather all the information I can. You guys just handle your end of things. Um, hello. Hello, Lito. I hope you are doing well. Yes. Oh, what impeccable timing. Yes, this was destined. When I consulted my star charts, I saw a portentous sign for you, Mario. I went. It went thusly. In the house of the dragon that flew through the air, beyond the reversible stair, near the empty black chest that cursed you, lies a clue to help your allies learn. I have no idea what it means, unfortunately. But I have no doubt of its importance as a sign for you and your friends. If you figure out this mystery, come and tell me immediately. Um, don't feel as bad. Okay, um, glad you feel a little better, I guess. Um, yes, I'm going, so what I'm going to be doing, I'm going to do Don Pianta's thing right now, because I want to get it done, and I never want to speak to him again. <laughs> um, and then I'm going to do Miss Mouse. Uh, yeah. Castaways return from the cursed island of the Keelhole Key, with treasure, maybe. Feed the corner. Mustache guys, back from Keyhole Key. I want to go. Who cares if I get cast? Guy who wants to make some easy money. Good for you. Alright then. What's your deal? What do you have? Anything good? I mean, these are cool, but they're expensive and I don't care. Never gonna use them, so. It's cool, but at what cost? So, yes, let us blow open this wall. It's been taunting us for ages. I know, I'll get all the badges at some point, but I don't have a huge amount of money and I want to save it for something that might be better. So, I'll, I'll get there eventually. I love how flat it is, it's great. Yeah, Francesca. Oh, poor boss! The big man's still been sick with loneliness ever since his daughter skedaddled! Our underboss, Frankie, has gone and the boss is in shambles. What's the syndicate to do? A scruffy gang of punk thieves is stealing jobs from us left and right. Hey, but enough about us and our stupid problems, huh? What can we do for you? What? Tickets for the ritziest train around! For the Excess Express? Whoa, you want tickets for that rolling wing thing? Oh, ain't nothing we can do about that. You yeah, give it us giving our tickets, <laughs> that's rich. You gotta talk to the boss for that. Francesca. I just can't see in the boss stand seeing the boss like this. 
If we could only, if we could help the boss see his daughter again. Hang on. Those two fo uh, fogly folk, Frankie and Francesca from Kyoho Key. Who's on the what now? What did you just say? Repeat that? Do you know where the young Miss Pianter is at? Really? No lie. I swear to you, if you're lying, I will turn you into confetti, so help me. Well, if that's where she is, why don't you bring her back here, huh? Be a pal. Well, go on shelves, but we can't leave the boss unprotected, you get me? Yeah, you bring us to Miss Fran young friend, Miss Francesca, and we'll ask the boss about you know, trying to get her done, still. You see, now that's better. Yeah, 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 okay, we're, we're good. We're on our way. 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 <laughs> Stop that now. Huh? There's a, there's a... Oh, there is a star piece right there. Huh. I don't know why I missed that. Um. Alright, cool. Um. So. Uh, I guess I'll be you because you're faster. And I could go via boat. But equally, I could go via pipe, which should be available to us. Should. We will see. Yeah, I'm just gonna skip this. Oh. Oh, right, it's a beach. I was like, this looks weird. But okay, yes, yeah, so it's like, that doesn't look jungle like. That's because it's a beach! We are right here. Beautiful. Now, where are they? <laughs> I don't remember where they are. I do not remember where they are. Where are they? What? Do I my, do make my way through? Why? <laughs> Alright then. Oh, there they are. Oh, hi there, Mario! What brings you back here? Can we do something for you? What? The boss is sick. Oh, poor daddy! Oh, no, not a time like this. Oh, I remember now. See, I just dropped the wedding ring Frankie gave me around here. I can't possibly leave until I find that ring. Otherwise, something may eat it. It must be somewhere between here and that skull rock. Listen for a sec, a sec of my fuzzy little coconut. Shouldn't we forget about that ring for now and go check out the boss? How could you say that, Frankie? The ring was a symbol of our love. We have to find it. We have to. Or maybe you just don't love me anymore. Is that it? Oh, of course I love you, my little bacon burger. None of your sweet talk now. You can have to say you love me a hundred times. A hundred times? Oh, come on now, babe. Of course I love you, my little short stack. Now, please, let's go. No, you have to say it 99 more times, Frankie. Oh, fine, you dizzy dame. I love you. 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 I love you, 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 I
I think I vaguely remember where it is. We'll see. Is it there? No. No, I think it's near the Skull Rock. But I'll double check these trees anyway, just in case it's not. You never know. This is such a gorgeous game. I wonder how the uh, the sails. Oh, there it is. It's very obvious. Smashed the wedding ring. <laughs> yeah, I wonder how the sales figures for this game have been going. I would love it if it was the highest selling Paper Mario. Because that means they'll make another like this. Because they would be stupid not to. <laughs> so. Let's make it happen! Got your ring. Oh, that's it! That's my ring! You found it! Frankie, now we can go home to Daddy! You sure can, my little cheese and cracker. Let's go! Let's go! We got no reason not to head back immediately. I'm honestly so glad I've got this done now. Because it means I don't have to think about it next time. Which is honestly a really, really big deal. <laughs> Mentally, it's wonderful. Okay, Mario, I think we're ready, pal. Yeah, we are. Let's go back to Roadport. Yes, we need to go back to Rogueport. Thank you. We are off, cast off to Rogueport, and you can skip it, gorgeous. Um, physical launch sales are above slight Oregon King. Sweet. We have to go see Daddy immediately! You got it, Francesca! Yeah, let's go. Oh, actually, no, I should probably still be you, because it's faster. Go, 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 go! Yeah, they move fast. <laughs> Get this thing over and done with! Let's go! The US couldn't order it online. Oh, really? Really? That's weird. That's bizarre, okay. Oh well. That's a weird decision, but... I mean, to be fair, let's, let's not count, like, ignoring anything other than, like, like, ignoring digital and, you know, anything outside of Japan, which obviously there's going to be well over a million combined. Like, Japan, 115,000 physical sales alone is huge. Like, that's a big deal. This game is easily sold over a million then. Easily. Daddy! 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 Wake up! Open your eyes! Boss! Francesca! Daddy! Boss! Oh, my little Francesca. You came back for me. And you too, Frankie. Francesca, Frankie, I was wrong. I was a stubborn old man. Forgive me. I know I may regret saying this, but I want the two of you to stay here with me. I can't bear to be away from you for the two lovebirds, and I'm an old man now. I need peace. Oh, okay. I guess the time has come for me to stop being so selfish, causing everyone trouble. Looks like even Don Pianta at the dawn of untimely death can't escape the old age. The time has come, everyone. I'm gonna retire. No, it's time. I mean it. And I want you to be my successor, Frankie. What do you say, Frankie? As of today, you are the new head of the Pianta Syndicate. What? The boss! You still got it in you. You're a spring chicken. You don't gotta do this. And I mean, me? Boss? 
No, you're the one, Frankie. I've been thinking about that for a long time now. You do just fine, kid. I've got a feeling about you. A good one. I want you to take care of Francesca and, and, and the rest of the syndicate the way I did. Boss! You, Mario. It looks like you... Uh, you, Mario. It looks like you've done yet another favor for me, kid. Yeah. How about that, boss? Oh, this is going to be uh, just beautiful, I know it. What did you guys do? Well, we kind of promised him something, boss. We told him we'd ask you about a ticket for the Express, Excess Express if he bought your daughter. <laughs> is that all? Oh, you had me worried there for a second. Go on over, my here, Mario. How many you want? One, two, ten? Help yourself. I can't do their voices. I don't know why. I'm so bad at them. Anyway, done. Boss! You're the boss now, thank you. Alright, see so ya. Yeah. yeah, so like, what excites me about the prospect of making another Paper Mario exactly like this? <laughs> Sweet Bean, come on! Knock it up for the pen name nonsense, will you, Frankie? Can we, Francesca? Huh? <laughs> for Francesca? Yeah, Miss Boss! <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you got a loyalty, yeah, just move on, I can't do their voices, I'm terrible at it. Uh, yeah, the thing that I'm excited about there being another game like this is... This game is great, absolutely fantastic, but it does suffer from backtracking on more than one chapter. Like, it's got such wonderful things going on for it, but it's also got a couple of really weird decisions. Like, so it would be really cool to, uh... I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna push the eyes, it's great. I heard that, my uglies, or what? So, the six crystal stars in Poshley Heights, is it? That's a rather nice piece of information. Thanks ever so. Hey, you are Beldum! Normally, this would be where I finally deal with you in that savage traitor Vivian. But something tells me that trying that alone might be unwise. So you live, for now. Instead, I'll just beat you into Poshley Heights and get that crystal star before you do. <laughs> That's not bad. Yeah, we're gonna go. But we've got, like, lots of other things to do first, so never mind. Uh, yeah, so... Yeah, this, like... Th this game just does a couple of things that I really would think could be done a lot better. And I feel like... In the development of this, in, of this remake, they realised that. Like, 20 times over. Um, but they didn't change certain things because presumably they wanted to keep it as I like identical to the original. I get it. I totally get it. Um, so I'm looking forward to seeing them actually, uh, you know, I'm looking forward to seeing them just change, like a, like make a new one, just learn from the mistakes, and and just make it a super creative, super streamlined. Uh, game for just like just nails everything. I I'm I'm ready for that. That's what I want from this. And I'm, I think that's probably what we're gonna get. Admittedly, it'll take three or four years, but it's what we're gonna get, which is exciting. Um, so we have got some stuff to do. We've started this quest, which is great, but we've got some exploring to do elsewhere. So, bear with. First off, hello! <laughs> Hi, Mr. Mushdust Cutie. I'm the one with the trouble. Hmm? I'm a pretty lucky girl to have a strapping fellow like you take on my trouble. Well, let me get right to it, okay? I've done all I can to find this one elusive badge, but i failed at every turn. The badge is hidden in Hooktail's lair. Of that much, I'm sure. I went to check that room after I heard you defeated Hooktail, but nothing. I did hear rumors for th that to find this badge, one has to use the wind. I have no idea what that means, though. Anyway, go look for it, okay, sweetie? Will do. Um, what's in here? Anything fun? Fun. Um. Um. 
Keep it pooping, it'd be draining. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, I will get these eventually, but I might pick up another close call. It can't hurt, can it? Alright, thank you so much. So, we've got a bunch of things to explore. Um, we've got two new abilities. The ability to blow things up, and the ability uh, to sail. So, both of those combined will unlock a fair few things around Rogueport and around the sewers. So, we're going to do them. Um, let's, let's do them. Uh, first off, there's one here. If I'm not mistaken. I am not mistaken. Boat! Yeah, it's nothing back there. Cool. Um, I don't think this will take too, too long. It shouldn't do, at least. Oh, there's more than meets the eye. Except no, there isn't. <laughs> Never mind. Uh, so, I don't remember what this is. It is... Double dip. Oh! Let's marry use up to two uh, items in a row during battle. That's quite good. Costs three. That's not actually that bad. That doesn't cost too much. Um, but yeah, that is that is good. Double dip is good. Makes sense that it was well hidden. Fair enough. Um... So, yeah, let's head into the sewers. I say, there's a couple of things I want to check out that we can do now. Which is exciting. Alright. Well, I guess number one is uh, right here. Destroy. Yeah! Anything behind here? No! But obviously there is the pipe and the big building over there! Uh, what is in said building? I honestly don't remember, so... Hello. <laughs> You've gone quite a ways, this is Chet Ripper's adjustment house! You think you want to change your stats or your partner's ranks? Then I can adjust those things for the low, low price of 39 coins? Do we need some adjustments? Ah. Ah. Ha ha ha. Great if you use lots of moves. Yeah, let's do that. So you get to choose what you take away. So you can take your HP away for FP. Uh, or BP. Um. BP or FP. Okay. BFP, BP, FP, BP, FP. I'm gonna do BP. Might regret it. Um, but yeah, I don't need 20 HP. Um, it's, uh... But you could go for the strats of reduce your HP to 5 and you're always in danger. Um, which means you can do quite a lot with that. Um, if you plan it out well enough. Which is lovely. Um... So, yeah, I'll, uh, I'll, I'll get there eventually, but uh, it's good to know you're here. I'll, uh, I'll be back. Oh, I will be back, because I am very, very tempted to do the danger strats. I'm aware it's a risk, but it's fun if it works. So, yes. Um, there's, uh, there's a pipe. Up here. No, not a pipe, a chest, but I don't remember how to get to, but it looks like it's a bombable wall. So maybe it's in this room. Oh, it's a pipe thing up there. Okay, right, right, right. I think I know how to do it. But anyway, I'm a boat. Um. So in conclusion, yes, I'm a boat. Yeah. I'm assuming I can get back there, right? Oh, you don't go that direction. Oh. Is that a thing you can 
jump to? <laughs> no! It is not. It's all done by pipes. Okay. Yeah, never mind. We'll get that. Ooh, so the next pair of shoes. I don't remember when you get them. I think it's after chapter six. But I don't really fully remember. But I have to assume that's roughly when. So uh, we'll be back for that, I guess. What? Wow. What? Who? Woo. Yeah, that. All that. Um. So we're gonna check this out. Oh yes. So no more, no more rolling under this. Rolling in the deep. No, you don't need to do that anymore. You can just blow it up. It is significantly faster. Hurrah. Um. Cool. You love to see it. Still can't go in there. Don't know how you get in there. I don't recall. Let's just blow up this wall or something. It is not. No, I do not remember. Um, there is probably a way. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure there is. Um, don't remember what it is. Um, now. Okay. Yeah, that's what I was worried about. Okay, you're new. Um, I'm gonna jump on you. You're not a problem. Yeah, I kinda need to swap partner to scan you. Ow. Uh, yes, I would like to scan you right now. That's a Koopa Troll. Koopa Trooper who protects himself with spiked armor. I just be a six attack of spawn defenses too. It, it attacks with its shell and with its head, and then sometimes charges up for a fierce move. Plus, if we take too long to win, it will call reinforcements. Yeah, so gnarly, huh? It's one of the worst of Bowser's guys. Koopa Troopers dream of being Koopa Trolls. Hey, and by the way, what do you think Bowser's doing now anyway? Eating? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Perhaps. Yeah. I'm not worried. Oh, that is unfortunate for you. You didn't need that to happen, but but it did, and I'm delighted. Bye. There you go. Five star points. Now I'm going to. Oh, oh, well, thank you. Um. Uh, I'm going to. Put on a spike shield. Yes, that's what I want. Okay, so is this something I can do with Bobbery? Is that what this is? No, it is not. Okay then. Fair enough. I wasn't sure. Ooh. Well, you're not dead yet. So that's good, right? Okay, I have scanned you both. I thought I had. Oh, they give you loads! Wow! Five points? They're like the... They're super... They both give you five? Okay, not bad. Exit power you get in the next land. Oh, okay, fair enough. Yeah, I have no recollection, but fair. Uh, I think there's a boat thing around here, which is why I came here. There's also that, but I can break now. Oh, you hit me four before you even began. Oh boy. Well, you're dead. <laughs> we are in the danger zone. Not bad. Oh, have I just remembered what we're about to do? Maybe. Maybe I have. Uh. Oh, there's also a thing I can blow there. I'm so glad I got the spike thing on. 
And you are so dead, wow. Yeah, you have no answer to that. And nor do you. I love being powerful. It is good. It is good. Can't deny. Right, so there's a blow thing here, so we'll do the blow thing. I don't really remember what it is, but, you know. Ah, okay. Um, cool. Yeah. Cool. Um, there is definitely a boat thing somewhere. Oh, maybe it's actually through here. Okay. Uh, so where does this lead then? Oh. Oh, that's very unhelpful. <laughs> that's very, very unhelpful. I'm assuming it's the same pit. Like, oh, no. That's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted at all. Okay. I see why it's done this. I don't care for it, though. Um, okay. Um. It's the easiest way back. Okay, no, that's not that bad. That's not that bad. I can explain why. Uh, if I go through here, go through the door, and then go left, am I right in thinking that that's just where I was? So, yeah, that'll work. Okay. I didn't lose any time. Okay, cool. I think that wouldn't have been as easy if it weren't for the fact that there is that magical room right there. I should do the pit now. Mmm, should I? I shall not. Uh -huh. I've got a special video coming out in 50 minutes. It's uh, every Disney game in 1992, and it's a video that I'm very proud of. Oh boy. Yeah, I remember this. Time to unboat, babes. Oh, that's cool. I'm no longer worried. But you should be. Oh, you are not dead. Okay. <laughs> Impressive. What's your deal? That's a spunnia. Its body is made up of springly, sp springy discs. Oh, its attack is 7, Christ. Magic Spear is 12, attack is 7, defense is 2. It may not look like much, but it's pretty tough. Watch out for those spikes on its head. It won't come at you with anything too weird. So just hang in there, okay? I am... Um... Not gonna take a chance. Okay, we're fine. I probably would have been able to win, but I just I just didn't want to risk it. I just wanted to wipe him out. It was easier to wipe him out than to Yeah, just be worried. Well that was easy. Cool, good stuff. So we can't get all of them because we can't get the one up there. Uh no, we can't get the one up there. We need uh we need the ability to jump very high. Um but that's fine. I mean, I'm assuming that I can't just, like, jump to it and mag make magic happen. Um, you might be able to, but uh, you, I, I don't think so. <laughs> Defend class! Okay, that's pretty good. Um, not bad, not bad, not bad, not bad. I'm happy with that. Is that everything down here? I think it is. I 
anything I wanted to look at? Am I forgetting anything? I don't think so. I think that is everything I wanted to look at. So, hooray! Um, yeah, I just need to make it back to checkpoint room and we're good. Alright. Whoops. <laughs> How did I manage that? Okay. Impressive. Not good, but impressive. Um, cool. Alright then. Alright, here we go. Heading back to Hooktail's castle. There is no quick way to do this. You just have to go. Is there a boat thing here? Or am I thinking of the first Paper Mario game? So I know there's one in the first Paper Mario. Um, but I can't tell if I'm like if there's one here as well. I, or yeah, I think it's just the first, and I've conflated it. Okay, that is fair. Alrighty, it's been a very long time since we've been to this section of Pedal Meadows, so let's go. I am not worried about any of this. I could fight them. It would be a waste of time. I wouldn't get much experience. So, I'm not going to. I will have to come back to all these places to make sure I get all the star pieces and whatnot. But, for now, we're fine. I could restore my health. I'm really close to a level up, so I'm not going to. Woo. So I know what I'm looking for. Um, if that helps, which it does. Um, uh, there are two rooms I need to go into. Um, and I will go to both. And honestly, they're not that hard to get to. Uh... It's just the fact that I have to go in and then get out again, and there's no, like... If there was some kind of magical item that allowed me to warp back to Rogueport, like, no problem. Easiest thing in the world. But the fact that there isn't is a bit annoying, so... It is what it is. Am I able to... I'm not able to break those... These, yeah, am I? No, I didn't think so. Or, or can I? No, I didn't think so. I don't have that ability yet. Give it time. Because there actually might be something behind those. But it's interesting that they are specifically breakable blocks. They didn't have to make them breakable. But they did. It is a choice. Anyway, do you remember ages ago, I saw that there was this crack in the wall, and I pointed it out, and yeah, I didn't do anything with it. Uh, yeah, that's the thing that we were asked to get by the wizards. You know, the wizard. There it is. What is it? It's an up arrow. What does that mean? I can find out. You will soon find out indeed. Uh, can you not use uh, amber on the blocks? Can you? Can Bobbery blow up cement blocks? Can they now? Oh, let me try. Did not, if he can, I did not know that. Yes, I'm fighting them. It's not a huge loss. Who's ready for an absolute slaughter? Thanks for the power block. Yay, I won. And I got one star point. This is why I'm not battling things. Because it's a waste of everyone's time. I will take the health though. But yeah, it is a tremendous waste of everyone's time. 
So is it this room? Is that where it was? Yes. Okay, if he can blow this up, this is very important because there's another grey block that I know of. No, we cannot. Alright. That is fine. Not a problem. Not a problem at all. Can I, like, shortcut this now? Or do I still have to... I might be able to get up with you. Nope, nope, I still have to go the long way around. Okay, fair enough. No cheating. No quick routes for you. No, none of that. Oh, right. You still have to go this way. That makes sense. <laughs> I'm sorry. Teal Rex just jumped into the abyss and somehow made it here. It was very impressive. God damn it. <laughs> One star bit for me. Yay. Just 14 more very small battles and I'll level up. Totally worth it. Yeah, the unfortunate thing about this quest is you do have to go all the way to Hooktail's room. Which is fine! But as I say, there's no way, like, there's no quick way back, you have to just go all the way back as well, which is just, it, it's a bit sucky. It's, it's what it is. I, I guess I'm fighting you as well. No! Oh, okay. You know what? I'm quite kind of you. Yeah, that'll do it. I don't even think there's like an enemy to fight when we get there. Like, I think it's just a case of do this and. Uh, yeah, do this and then. have fun. <laughs> I don't know if I have to do the paper plane, but I'm just going to do it. <laughs> it's the quickest way of doing it. Alright. E Plane. Make. I don't remember if there is anything like specifically really uh, lengthy about this area. I don't think there is. No, there isn't. It's just make it to the end. Okay. Right, we're gonna hopefully run past all of them then. Yeah, no chance. Yeah! Such a cool camera angle. It's so good. It's so, so good. It's a bit disorientating when you're going this fast on a Yoshi, but it's so good nevertheless. Alright, fine, you, I guess. Oh, so many of you. No. God's sake, fine, multi bounce. Alright, good, there we go. Cool! We will, at some point, Level up. It probably won't be before the next chapter. <laughs> I guess it depends on what we have to, like, fight on the other requests. Mmm, it feels like there's something here. It sure does. I did it. I solved the riddle. It's terrible looking badge. Yes. <laughs> Yay! Is there anything else in this room? Uh, 
No, it does not look like it. It is a very empty room, actually. It's there. I don't know, like, what the radius is for it telling you if there's a star piece here. Okay, I don't think there's a star piece here. Alright. Right, back we go. Again, there's no quick way back. Annoying as it may be. So we will just have to go all the way back the slow way. Which is fine. I, I think that Super Paper Mario had quick ways back. Um, and I think that, uh, yeah, if, uh, whatever their next game is, they'll do that. I'm surprised they didn't add one, given that they've had so many things that they've added to this. Like, they've had little micro things that have been really good. So I'm surprised they didn't go with that, but it's whatever. It's not the worst thing. Anyway, down we go. I mean, I guess we're kind of there already. Kind of. Nope, 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 nope. Do not battle me. This is not the time. There we go. We did it. We have got the elusive badge and we got whatever that arrow thing was. Yes, what is that arrow thing? Arrow thing, you say? What does it mean? What does it mean? We've got to find out. Wow, can you believe? We will find out. We are going to find what? Hmm. It's exciting. Ish. Sort of exciting. Mm, debatable. But yeah. No, it is exciting. It's actually a really, really good thing. It's. It is. I've been specifically saving up for it. If you're not sure of what that means, you will very soon. But uh, yeah, we, we did good. We did very good. I think this has been a very productive stream. We've uh, we cleared all chapter five. We set up stuff for chapter six. We did these quests. We've done all the stuff in the sewers that we can so far. Yeah, we've done a lot. It's important. It's important stuff. Because I've got the uh, the thing where I can stand on spikes, I could get the uh, the badge that allows me to remove hammers for the sake of um, for the sake of having jumps only, but I really like the Quake Hammer. It's a really powerful item. What is that in your hand? The up arrow. What's this? An up arrow. An up arrow? Up. Of course! <laughs> yeah, that's fair. This is the Ultra Stone. So that is what the star sign meant. I picked this up at a flea market years ago and forgot it was in the attic. With this, I can power up your partners even more! Yes. There you go. We are cooking now! Can I power up a partner right this minute? Yep, still costs the same, only costs three. Uh, should we going to use Rally Wink to increase Mario's turns by one? Very powerful. Um, also, I just want her to be more powerful anyway, because I use it all the time. But that is a very good move. For sure. Yay! Get a power of more. Uh, I do, I care about power of you. Should we be able to use Infatuate to confuse all enemies? Be able to use Stampede to tackle ground enemies. Um, Sail Slam to tackle ground enemies. Um, have first replenish HP. 
Hold fast to damage direct attackers. I'm gonna go. Yeah, let's do that. I I don't know if that I don't think they're the same people. I just think they have similar names. It's not really explained. I don't think. Um, but yes, that's Parrot Maw, T Rex. Oh, Parrot Bobbery as well, I guess. Bobbery's pretty good. Shazubi. Shazubi. Uh, actually, before I. Before I power up. Return someday. Cool. Um, so there are two more quests to do uh, in town, but I will do them next time. Uh, I'm gonna stop. Uh, shortly after this, um, but uh, I, yeah, as I say, I think we've done really good. We've done loads of stuff. I'm very proud of what we've accomplished. We are a wonderful team. Now you'll never guess I did. I found your badge. <laughs> that face. Does it mean you found the badge? Sure did. Well, this is certainly, this is certainly the badge I was looking for. Oh my, yes. <laughs> now, my sweet, promise to hear me out without getting mad. You see, I was the one who hit that badge. It was a little game of mine. I have to apologize, but I knew you would find it, my handsome cheese hunk. You may have been even more, you may have even more badge finding skill than I do. I just thought of something. Perhaps I should just travel with you from now on. Because <laughs> I'm sure to find lots of badges that way, don't you think? Now, about that reward, let's see. I think this badge that you managed to find, but I expect you to lead me to more. So yeah, just a uh, different, different sound effects sound mousy. Now let me formally state that you will now enjoy the pleasure of my company. Yeah, Miss Mouse joined your party. Miss Mouse's abilities are primer. As X and Miss Mouse will sniff the surrounding air. If there are any items or objects hidden nearby, she'll point you towards their general direction. Very, very helpful indeed. Something nearby. Whoa, let's go. There it is. Yeah, wow. How did you not spot it? Found it, something right near us, sweetie. But yes, uh, reaction will change depending on the distance from the item. Very powerful! So, not bad at all. Um, she can steal an enemy's item. Oh, that's how you can guarantee items from an. Oh, okay, that's good. I wasn't sure. But yeah, that's that's cool. Miss Mouse gets to join you, um, which I absolutely love. Um, so, I, yeah, I'll see what her, like, upgrades are. I will upgrade her. I don't remember what they are. Definitely upgrading Bobbery, but I wanted to upgrade her as well. Um, because I didn't know if her, like, stuff was better. Um, so let's see. Uh, but yeah, that's every, that's every party member. Right there. It is done. That's pretty satisfying, I must say. We've done good. Get a power more? Yes. There we go. Shazibi. Um, Shazubi again. Okay, so what's her final power up? She'll be able to smooch to boost Mario's HP. He'll be able to use a bomb blast to attack all enemies. Um... Hmm. You know what? No, I'm going Bobbery. Bobbery's is really cool. <laughs> uh, will I do any vids on stream uh, Kingdom Hearts? I've done so much Kingdom Hearts stuff in the past. Uh, many randomizers. I'm sure I will be doing more randomizers in the future. Um, that is, there is no doubt. I've done many, many. Uh, I've got many playthroughs on my YouTube channel. Um, so there's, there's no doubt of that. Um, but yeah, there you go. So, that's very good. We did a lot of cool stuff. Um, thank you very much for watching. Uh, I'll be streaming this again more during the week. Um, and uh, also, I've got a very cool video coming out in 30 minutes. 
uh, of every Disney game in 1992, but I'm very happy with it. So I hope you check it out and enjoy and leave a like and share it everywhere. And uh, I'd very much appreciate that. And I will see you later. Take care.